Hey there, veteran guardians and new light players. This is Cella Metals bringing you another Destiny 2 Beyond Light video. In the previous video, we helped Varix establish a hidden network, but all of a sudden, the darkness has beckoned us to commune with it. So we did. I made our way to a location called the Beyond, where it suddenly a piece of it landed on Europa, but the good news is, uh, the Extra Stranger, Erisborn, and the Drifter have made it there on time, preventing uh, the Fallen, commanded by uh, Aramis, to claim that area. And now, the Exo Stranger had given us the Splinter of Darkness, and long story short, we tried out the new subclass. But it didn't last long because it's a practice. Like a trial run. So anyway, long story short, we just killed a bunch of Fallen, did some other objectives, and we're going to face one of uh, Aramis's lieutenants, the Warrior, which is Pylax. Um, before I start, there's a chest over here. I'm gonna go grab it. Alright, let's go. Pylax okay. found fame at Twilight Gap, yes. Fame for ruthlessness, for final deaths. For Phylax, there is no greater joy than battle. You must challenge her, but use caution, Guardian. Okay, let's get in there. Close to the traveler. Protected. Or I did. Since you got that splinter, I might feel further away than ever. Okay, let's head down here. What is that? Holy snap! What kind of vex thing is that? Oh my god, boom! Oh, all I can tell you it's a one-eyed thing with legs and no arms. Oh. Big on hell spawn! Oh, let me clear out these enemies. What drives you to see? Oh, do you fight for glory? For power? My elixir fight for the fight itself. There is nothing beyond it. Let me teach you this lesson. Oh, gosh. I'm sorry, I got myself preoccupied and terrified of that brand new Vex enemy. Oh, reminds me of one of those uh, old enemies that I used to play back in uh, Star Wars Jedi Knight 2 Jedi Outcast. Those automated mini machine thingies. Oh, gives me nightmares. It still creeps me out when I was a kid. But now looking at a Vex version of it. Oh, ho, ho. My nightmares are coming back to life. I see different kinds of shanks. You know what type of shank I missed back in D1? Repeater shanks. It's a shank with a machine gun. Same size as a regular shank, but with a machine gun. Ouch. 
penetrated. I've never seen the Fallen's military forces so organized. For many years, Elixni lived scattered, yes. Aramis took our broken houses and forged an army. And she wants to give that army stasis if they ever came for the last city. Yeah. If she said... Well, not she. If Varric said that Aramis had collected all of the broken houses, that means that's House of Devils, House of Kings, House of Winter, House of Exile, probably House of Wolves. Maybe some of the leftover houses from House of Rain, too. I just can't believe I remember all those houses. Oh, great. Another one of those terrified machines. Big gun! Ugh. Easy to kill, but the looks give me the creeps. Uh... I'm supposed to go here. Is there any leftover fallen? Oh, no. I'm supposed to shoot these. Another transformer. Destroying that will bring down the barrier. I see now you are a worthy challenge. A chance to hold my blade. Come by me, machine spawn. I am waiting. Okay, back there. I figured it out before Ghost called it out. Just stating a fact. Whoa. One of those giant mechs. Technology taken from the Kells Scourge. Another splintered house united under Aramis. Yep. It's confirmed. Those little mechs are confirmed technology from Insurrection Prime. Fact confirmed. Whoa. Look, there's a splinter. And there's Pyrex. I will bring your corpse to Erebus again. I will forge myself a ring from your armor. Please don't. Like that. Where's Pylax? There you are. Whoa. I don't know what she did. Well, it's giving me the creeps a little bit. Whoa. Nope. That was close. Too close. platform was gone. I gotta be careful next time. Oh no. Oh no. That was close. Skill will earn you a quick death. Oh, I gotta move. I gotta go over there. I guess. Oh no. Get up there.
I gotta check my weapons. Alright, let's go. I gotta be careful of these guys. Yeah. It looks like the darkness is giving me a hand here. All right. Come on. Let's go for another run. Cover. One more go. There we go. Merrick's Phylax is down. Uh -huh. the general doesn't destroy the army but this is a start at least let's get that splinter back to camp i just can't believe it that almost at the last bit of phylax's health the darkness just gave me their subclass to use it against her holy snap okay we're almost there to the camp and also I should apologize to you guys uh, if you guys are wondering why I have uh, this sparrow this was from a deluxe edition uh, that I pre-ordered so if you're wondering how to get this sparrow go to the tower talk to Master Raul he'll have your sparrow waiting for you there and that's it All right, extra stranger, I'm here, and guess who's here? The Drifter and uh, Eris Morn. Didn't see them for a while, but yeah. Okay, let's go talk to. Aramis's presence on Europa is not happenstance. Temptation set the wheels in motion, but obsession propelled her here. To destroy the light with an army of darkness, she and her followers make those selfish choices moment to moment. The darkness. Places a spotlight on our desires, as it once did me and those I cared about. For a time, I had forgotten. Humanity relies on our selfless acts to bring about a better world. Darkness is no more than a tool with which we do so. With splinters of darkness still in hand, Aramis remains an immediate danger to humanity. Look within. Focus your power. Let it grow. The ziggurat awaits. Okay, Nexus Stranger is thrilled. Not only did it accept the power of stasis, but you put it to use to taking down Phylax and retrieving her splinter of darkness. Continue working with Varric to track down the next member of Aramis's Dark Council. Once you get a hold of their splinter, the Exo Stranger can use it to enhance your own, which will in turn strengthen your proficiency with stasis. But don't get carried away. You have a way to go before you can face Aramis. Now that you accepted stasis, you must learn to resist the temptations of the darkness and use it solely for the good of humanity. With that, she hands you back your splinter, now infused with phylaxes, readying you for the next stage of stasis. 
attune your enhanced splinter of darkness at the ziggurat in beyond. Let's do that. the next one. Let's attune it. Commune with the next crux of darkness in the this Bray hour, of Exus. This stasis. I'm worried it's taking more of a toll on you than you realize. I'm able to bring you back from death with the light. But I may not be able to if this power consumes you. up another transmission from Aramis. To my Elixni sisters and brothers out amongst the stars and here at home on Europa, we have suffered a great loss today. Our beloved warrior Phylax was murdered by pawns of the once great machine. As always, they eagerly seek to eradicate us. Remember, Light only burns bright so long, but darkness is forever. So this is the Bray Exoscience. Wow. That looks amazing. Can't believe a facility like this survived here. And there's the crux of darkness. Alright. What do you got for us today? Okay, I see. This is the stage two of the stasis. Pretty much, uh, a lot of things have improved. Yeah, definitely improved a lot. It's almost dead. And there we go. Lesson done. Let's end this communion. I'm here to fight for the light. And so are you. If this is how we're going to do it, I'll be by your side. But we are toying with power neither of us understand. And I have no control over it. If anything happens to you, I may not be able to help. But I'll do what I can. I have seen what power has done to Aramis. But perhaps you are different. Perhaps there is hope. Praxis. He is the visionary mind behind Aramis's technology. He brings power from the darkness itself. But Verex was not privy to his secrets, his experiments. You must discover how he creates these dark weapons and stop him. Okay, Ferex is surprised and impressed that you've managed to defeat Pylax. He now believes you may be able to capable of wielding stasis without being corrupted. He tells you that your next target is Praxis, the elixir who created the technology that allow House Salvation to wield darkness. Defeat him 
and Aramis's plans will come to a halt. Varix believes he has been experimenting on the Vex? And if you disrupt his experiments, you might get his attention. Investigate Praxis, the technocrat's plans in Eastern Abyss. Okay. Why don't I have space? Oh! It appears that I have blue weapons blocking my inventory. Let's pick it up now. Okay guys, we're here at Astron Abyss, and our objective here is to find Vex and kill them because they drop tracking devices. There's a bunch of Vex right here. Yeah, see? These, uh, I guess these green triangles? Yep. So all you need to do is find those green triangles, and this should be enough. Got that done, and we need to head to the ridge to shut down the complex. Oh, they killed it. Complex is secured. Of that down server. I know where we can find Praxis. There's the marker. Is it? No, it's farther away. Oh, it is here. Never mind. And that's the end of the video, ladies and gentlemen. Now I'm gonna put a stop here so that way I can continue fighting the technocrat in the next video. So if you enjoyed this video, leave a like and check out my YouTube channel for the latest Destiny 2 content. If you want to check out other Destiny 2 or gaming content, you can check out my friends' YouTube channels, which I'll leave their YouTube channel links in the description box below. And also, if you want to get notified and for extra content, check out my Twitter at Selon Metals. Thank you guys for watching. Selon Metals is out. And stay safe out there.